first of all i'm really excited to for um a qadil hasina ke naam and uh, just like i was for jurails <laughs> um my my first question is from both of you tell me briefly about what the what what the drama is about should yeah, i offer, please okay, yes then i will so i think it's about women um uh, six seven different women and each episode has a different leading uh, lady and each woman in in these episodes has a cause for which she is ready to kill um she whether it's based the cause is revenge or lust or love or justice uh it's the passion of the woman it's the strength and commitment of the woman to follow her cause to the bitter end this is i think the underlying uh, message mm. of of the series mm-hmm. yeah yeah i feel uh you know the common motives do include uh, crime and punishment and uh, love and hate and revenge and betrayal so i think it covers a lot of uh, those kind of sentiments where uh um, you want to see the you know you generally see men and men do all of that uh but it's actually uh, females and males now in this and that's the i think that's the most refreshing bit of katil uh that your main protagonist or antagonist is actually a female uh so that is a nice twist and a sort of a refreshing feel to uh katil um i'm really loving the the um the outlook that's coming out of um yeah. the 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 posters that are coming out on your mm. instagrams stunning. instagram it's stunning really stunning yeah you're right yeah beautifully and done samia samia arif is samia our uh, illustrator and oh. uh, humayo is our photographer and uh, they were the same team that worked on uh, churels uh, posters also and they're working on kartil and uh, they're fantastic i love samia's work uh, it's very detailed it is yes. kind of dark oh. in a nice way <laughs> you know yes Actually, definitely it's really very talented ma- very talented woman mm. yes it's really making us uh, really really excited for yeah, the for the done, show she's done she's done a job hasn't she she's done it she, <laughs> yeah. it's it's got to you it's yeah, got you ex- uh-huh. feeling excited and looking forward So um briefly what is your uh, a little bit about your role and your um your characters in the drama Bio Khala we need to Bio Khala okay Bio Khala So my character's cause is justice mm-hmm. I'm the widow of of a, a, a judge who was very upright his slogan was fiat justitia beriat mundus which means that justice should be done even if you have to lose your life so she is a very upright woman she is very compassionate and fun and everything but this is her cause justice is her cause and justice is what she sees to it is done so that's my role that's the role of um, masi ma she is full of yeah. fun she is full of she is a masti khor also she likes a little mm-hmm. siggy with her with her friend you know in the corner and she likes to do a little but when it comes to the cause and the passion she is immovable and that's massima mm. yeah right um for me natasha i think uh, mehak uh, is an ordinary girl and uh, she just uh, she fell in love uh, in college on this uh, lie there was a lie that was uh, thrown at her and and she falls in love with the wrong person and how she stays in love with that wrong person without knowing yeah. so she's a hopeless romantic for sure um and then her transition to what she finds out later and how she deals with that truth uh, that revelation um how she turns into the kapil hasina from this ordinary girl um that is mehak for you I don't know if I want to tell more. No, that's very <laughs> nicely put. No, but yeah. that was very, very vivid. Yeah. Got the picture. I did it. Yeah. So, so yeah. um, Beauty, you were um for um your for your film Cake. Yeah. Um, it it was an amazing character. I really loved your work in Cake and Thank in Ek Ek Chuti Love Story. <laughs> Thank um, you. 
<laughs> and especially when you said, um, I don't know if it was an interview or at the premiere at in, in London, um, that, that there was some extempore dialogues um, by you in case. And, and <laughs> I just this, loved it. <laughs> you know, this That's is so now, her. No, it's a given with me. And the writers yeah. and directors have now given up on trying to curtail <laughs> because they know that when I get into the character, I must do and say what the character would do and say, would whilst they? keeping very totally into the story. They're not mm -hmm. upsetting the storyline in any way. Mm -hmm. But yes, yes, a lot of innovation. And uh, it was accepted by the, by the writer and the director. <laughs> so I was lucky. I, I give my best when I can um, dig in and produce uh, right. whatever I feel, I mean, I'm, to become the character and then to do what that she or she would do or say. So uh, have you done the same thing in uh, Katil Haseena Unkinam? And also, um, are we going to see you writing any any dramas or any any films? I, I, I'm writing and I have written, but uh, I've been a bit of a dreamer and been very non-ambitious. So mm -hmm. I haven't done a lot of the things I really should have done. My, my work is like not immense it's not uh, um, too much of it but whatever I do I put my heart in it and yes now I am writing because there's so many characters living in my head that are popping out and saying you know give me a life <laughs> 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 so yeah Masima too uh, Minu gave me a free hand and mm. I added my own bits to it right so um, Sarvath when every time uh, a project comes out of Z and uh, Pakistani and, and, you know, there's a collaboration with Pakistan. There's a whole, um, you know, social media trolling and um, a lot of negativity that comes out of Pakistani audiences. Why do you think that happens? And, and what would you like to say to those people? You know, I mean, uh, we're lucky. I thought, uh, sorry, I just got this bad cramp in my foot. Um, <laughs> Move it around. I just, yeah, I just Move feel that... Um, yeah, we all follow. Mm -hmm. uh, I I feel that uh, we still are not told uh, as we were expected to. Uh, there's still a lot of love that's coming uh, our way with all these collaborative works. I mean, obviously, there is a certain percentage that is never happy with whatever you're making. And now I think we're just so thick-skinned that it really doesn't matter because obviously, I I know where they're coming from and I, I know their mindset mm. uh, you know they have a certain exposure so it's fine everybody's entitled to their opinion uh, we can't take it personally because we're, we're actors who have to work in different characters and projects and um, if we start taking these things too hard I think we cannot sustain as good actors uh, so that is fine uh, but I uh, I am also um, in I mean, I'm just really happy that people after Katil uh, posters and everything came out, the kind of response that we got was amazing. Well, more positive uh, we, than negative. More positive than negative, That's I'd right. say. So I'm. it's very exciting to see that the audience is actually looking forward to, uh, you know, something which is different, like Churel's. Uh, and because we've given them a Churel's ka dose, so they know that something exciting is cooking. So it's it's been a great uh, feedback uh, so far. So what sort of feedback do you get from the Indian audience? And is there any particular comment or anything, any feedback that's like stuck in your mind coming from the Indian audiences? I mean, I had Karan, Karan Johar message me. Oh. He, 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 he DM'd me on Instagram oh, uh, wow. saying that he loved the show and he loved our work. And, and so that in itself was such a huge reward for all of us. Uh, and, and uh, you know, everybody was watching Jurel's at that time and they, they were excited. And now again, with something coming like that, they're again excited. So um, it's been good so far. Yeah, uh, let them see it. Then we'll get yeah. more feedback. And trolls, <laughs> troll people who troll will always troll. I mean, it's their yeah. pressure. It's what they've never, they are what I call the sofa brigade, you know. They've been sitting <laughs> and uh, the Farij brigade sitting on the sofa, not no. doing anything. So unka sirf do ye ho sakta, express themselves unseen behind a, a you know, yeah. a computer. So 
let's give them a break also <laughs> and yeah. not take it too hard here. Huh. So we also have um, this great uh, male cast that's in the drama. What would you would you like to briefly uh, say something about your male co-stars, especially Salim Miraj Saab, who's my favorite actor? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, we we have some amazing uh, uh, you know male uh, star lineup in oh, Kapil. Amazing. Uh, we have uh, some really amazing actors like Salim. I'm also such a huge fan of Salim Miraj Saab. and uh, you know i'm always in awe of him how he gets into a character within a split second and gets out of it and then get gets back into it so it's just almost magical and all the rest of them uh, esan and ob and sheryar and um mohammad ahmed saab is also in mohammad ahmed saab ah. oh my god that's your partner <laughs> <laughs> um, not in this right. one not in this one in ek yeah. jyoti and k ki was ek but not jyoti. this one yeah hmm. Yeah. So, so but I had, yeah. I had Fawad, who I had in Ek Jhooti right. also, and you had in Cake. Yeah. But I feel that he is he is magic. He is he magic. Is. He gave me so yeah. much. We had a very very intense role together. Yeah. And he supported me through it, and I hope I supported him through it. But I feel he's like the Nawazuddin, you know, of yeah. uh, of Pakistan because I have seen him huliya badalte ve, and wow. he's he just. Uh, and he's so understated he doesn't grab the limelight yeah. yes i think he's amazing i mean so i i yeah. worked with him on this one on um right um, okay so what uh, in the end what's your message uh, for the audience any any kind of a message if it's uh, whether it's about the show or whether it's otherwise about something else i just like to say that uh, everybody needs to see katil hasina with an open mind Mm-hmm. and uh, you know uh, like bio khala said that uh, it's a cultural thing and and we're just trying to get out of it so watch it with an open mind see how you feel we want to make people uncomfortable mm-hmm. so we're hoping that some get uncomfortable but then some also get inspired and mm-hmm. that's what these examples of these six seven women are right I, I'd say the same. Say? No, uh, Sarvat, you said it for me. It's exactly what I feel. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. It was lovely talking to both of you, and um, I'm I just can't wait to watch the show. I'm just so excited for it. Mm-hmm. Um, so take care and have a really nice day. Um, yeah, thank you, Natasha. See you guys thank soon. You. Nice yes, talking to you, Natasha. Nice. We'll tune into your blog, LondonNights.com. Is it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. We will tune in. Uh, so when uh-huh. yeah, we will enjoy you from now on, I get got to know you now, and it'll be fun to yeah. see you on your blog. Thank you yeah. so much. Thank you so uh-huh. much. Thanks, Natasha. Okay. Bye-bye, Allah Natasha. Bye bye. Bye bye.